What I want to do today is connect our Pocket and Notion apps so that whenever a new item is saved in our Pocket app, a database item will automatically be created in our Notion app. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial so you can try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap by clicking the button on the left-hand side of the screen. Because I want Pocket to trigger the creation of a new database item in my Notion app, I'll need to use Pocket as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Notion sees a new database item is created, it's going to run this workflow. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click New Item as my event and click Continue. The first time we set up Pocket, we'll need to authenticate it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Pocket account. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryptions when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to Zapier's security and trust page in the description as well. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click Test Trigger. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our action. Type in Notion in the search bar and select it on the drop down menu. Next, click Create Database Item and click Continue. From there, I could select our account and authenticate Notion with Zapier, just like I did with my Pocket account. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue and it's time to assign the Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps field. First, pick the database you want your Pocket link to appear on. I'm going to click my favorite pocket links. Once I do that, the properties from my selected Notion database will appear below. Mine are listed as article title, URL, and description. So I'll cross-reference the drop-down items with the titles listed. Under article title, I'll click resolved title. Under URL, I'll click resolved URL. And under description, I'll click excerpt. Then I'll click continue. Next, click Test Action, and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, anytime a URL is saved in Pocket, a new database item will automatically be created in Notion. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier can do so much more with these two apps and thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.